Okay, what we're going to do is a lower cervical paraspinous block on this young lady. She's got a migraine headache. She's had it for a couple days now, and it's really not getting any better. And the way this block works is it interrupts the circus motion of some of the reentry type pain fibers that run from the back of the head down through the neck and up again. And what you're looking to do is block between C7, C, and C6, and you want to feel for the spinach process. You might go about an inch off either side. So you're down around C6, C7, inch off either side. You're going to go in and put about a CC and a half of pivocaine in each side there. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to clean her up a, a bit. And I've already kind of got a feel for where we're going on her. And I kind of marked her a little bit with the um, my fingernail. And then once we get her numbed up a little bit, what I'm going to do is put a little bit of lidocaine in on either side. So here's the spinous process here. This is about C7 and a little bit off to the side. Right here I'm going to raise a little wheel and then we're going to do the same thing on the other side. And I've cleaned the area with chloroprep already. So we're good in, in that respect. And, that, and what we're going to do is we're going to clean the area a little bit more editorial comments from her son who's watching. I think he's, his plan is to learn how to do this and the next time she gets this type of a headache he's going to take care of it for her. I'm just going to put a pair of gloves on so I can feel my landmarks a little bit better. And you use about an inch and a half needle and I gotta tell you Larry Malik is a guy who told me about this technique and they use it extensively down in Georgia where he is and he has about an 85-95% success rate with it and I've seen him do it for toothaches as well as uh, migraine headaches so he'll do it with any type of facial pain and seems to get very 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 good results. Look at one more of those for me. All right one more time we're going to prep you. Okay and I've got two syringes full with bupivacaine. They each have about an inch and a half needle on them. And they've got a um, one and a half cc's of bupivacaine. So we're going to go straight in. You're going to go parallel to the ground. Aspirating as we go in. And now I'm just going to put in, slowly put in the bupivacaine. And I pull out just a little bit as I put the last little bit in there. That's one side done. And we're going to do the other side now. Again, feel for my landmark. Come over just about an inch, inch and a half. Aspirating as we go in. And we're in the muscle. And again, we're going to put a cc and a half of the bupivacaine in there. And that's it. Massage that around a little bit so it gets in there and I have a feeling that it's the massage more than anything that makes the headache go away.